Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to resize your photos and then also change their format if needed using the Windows Photos app. All right, so we have this image here. It's two and a half megabytes and there are the dimensions. So we could double click it to open it in Photos. And you can see we have the same information down here at the bottom. So to resize it, you want to do it right from here. You don't want to go into Edit because that will get rid of the option to resize. But of course, you know, you could change dimensions to do that kind of stuff within the editor. But we're just going to do the simple method here. All right, so if you click on the ellipsis here, the three dots, you can see we have the option to resize image. All right, so right now it's set to high at 80%, and there's the size. Now it does have an option to go up higher, which will make the file size bigger, but I wouldn't really put too much faith in it actually being able to make the uh, picture look better without doing it in the editor. All right, so go back here to 80. All right, so you could also change the size in pixels or percentage. So if you want it to be a certain amount of pixels, let's say 2,000, you'll see it adjusts here as well. And then you could also do percentage. So that's 57%. So that's if you want to change the dimensions. But if you just want to change the file size, you want to use this. So let me cancel this, go back in. All right, so we're going to put this down to, let's say, 50%. And you can see it went from 2.4 megabytes to 300K. So we'll click on Save. Now you can overwrite your current one, but we're going to just give it a different name so we can compare them. All right, so here are our two files here 2.4 megabytes and 365K. You can see the dimensions are the same. All right, so let's open up the original again here. All right, so that's how that one looks. And let's go over to the reduced one. So you can see down there it changed to the smaller file size. And also the file name up here changed. So you can see they look pretty identical there. So if you're not doing things like, you know, looking for high quality print jobs or using them for some kind of graphics project, uh, this should work out just fine. Especially if you want to email a bunch of pictures and you want to reduce them first. Uh, you could just come in here and use the Photos app to do so. All right, so let's go back to the first one here. So let's go back here now, go to Resize Image. Now let's change it to, let's say, a PNG. And now you can see it's larger in size when you save it as a PNG. So let's click on Save. There you go. Running.png, save that. All right, so now here's our original one. Here's our reduced one, and here's our PNG. So you see they all kind of look the same, but if you need something in one of these other formats, uh, you can convert it pretty easily here. All right, let's look at the other formats real quick so you have an idea of what you could use. All right, so you have JPEG, PNG, TIFF, and BMP. So those are your options. So obviously if you open a PNG, you can convert it to a JPEG if you want. And then, like I said, just use the slider here to adjust the quality. You can check out the new size down here. And then if you want to reduce the dimensions, you could do it in pixels or percentage. So as you can see, it's a pretty easy way to reduce the size of your image files. And then also change the dimensions. And then also change the file type if needed. All right. Thanks for watching. And be sure to subscribe.